guys, today I'm going to be doing a collective haul. I have shoes, clothes, a new bag that I got, accessories. I have a lot of stuff to show you guys. It's all stuff that I got within the past two weeks. And I'm going to start off with accessories. I got the accessories from Bobble Bar. So the first thing I got is this little necklace. And it has scalloping, it's like a scalloped pendant, but these little things move. These actually move around. It's not like a solid piece, and it just has white gems on it. It's on a nice dainty gold chain too. Thing, I'm not really into thick chains, so I really like this. It's going to be nice for layering necklaces as well. Next thing I got are these two cuff bracelets and one the cuff is round and then it has a little cuff on the end that has white gems and a pearl and then this other one the cuff itself is squared and it has two pearls at both of the openings so I thought these were super cute. The size is pretty adjustable like you can tighten them or open them up to make them a little bit looser so you can wear them pretty much wherever you want on the arm. You can wear them like that or you could wear them just the plain bands but I like them to show the enclosures on them as well. The next thing I got from Bobble Bar are these little earrings. They're studs and I took a picture and posted these on Instagram and I'll have my Instagram link down below so you guys can see the picture too. It's a straight bar stud and then the back of the earring and the stud are connected by a chain. When you close the back to the stud, the chain hangs down under your lobe and it's just a little, <clears throat> I'm sorry, it's just a little gold dainty chain and I love like the geometric shaped studs. So these are just little uh, rectangles and they go up vertically. So You guys have probably noticed that I like layering my necklaces. That's why I'm all about dainty chains because then it doesn't look too clunky. I just like very dainty feminine pieces. And this is a necklace that's already pre-layered. It has three pendants and then at the very end there's where they meet at the triangle and then there's two pendants that hang down from the three. So there's a straight stud. It has a little white gem on the corner. A circle pendant with white gems and then they meet on this bottom one at a triangle and then they have those two that hang down and it's on a nice dainty chain. <laughs> if you guys go to bobblebar.com slash daisy you can shop all the pieces that I just showed you and you can go see more pieces from Bobble Bar. I know that I always thought Bobble Bar was kind of like the big um, statement necklaces which aren't really my style but they have tons of just dainty, simple, clean, jewelry pieces, which are totally my style, so on both ends of the spectrum, there's something for everybody. And Bobble Bar was nice enough to give me a coupon code for you guys. At your checkout, you can type in the promo code DACY and you'll get 20% off of your order. And I'll have all the information on the coupon code and everything in the description box so that you guys can read up on it and see if it's something you'd like to take advantage of. So I'll start off with my bag and then I'll do shoes and then we'll end with clothes. The bag that I got is actually from Luke because I've been asking for a small crossbody because all of my bags are huge tote bags and I just bring around so much crap. It's a Kate Spade leather crossbody. Um, I don't know the details on it otherwise I would tell you guys but I didn't buy it for myself so I don't really technically know. But it's just like a little small bag. You can wear it crossbody. I prefer to wear it as a shoulder bag rather than crossbody. It really limits the amount of stuff that I can bring to essentials and I can't bring around a bunch of crap. It has this little front pocket and then it also has a main pocket and there's no compartments on the inside. So I've already transferred pretty much all of my stuff to it. It does have a little flap in there but yeah. Three pairs of shoes. The first pair of shoes that I got are from Windsor and they are these black heels with the ankle strap which I think is really really cute. I love ankle strap heels and as you can see there's kind of this opening in the back and then they have a little bit of a cheetah or leopard. I don't really know which is which but it has a little bit of animal print. I'm not a fan of animal print in huge doses but I like just little accents of animal print. Actually I really only like accents of cheetah print. I don't really like zebra or anything like that but these I think are really cute and as long as I keep the rest of the outfit simple and clean then I don't think the animal print is going to be too, you know, in your face or too crazy. So really like these. Next pair of shoes that I got are from Target and they are the brand 
Massimo. And they are black faux leather mules with a peep toe. And I absolutely love these. Seriously, seriously love these. And then the last pair of shoes that I got are, oh my gosh, I have been looking for these shoes for over a year. They are recreations of Steve Madden nonstop booties, which I love the Steve Madden nonstop booties. I would have paid full price for them, but if I could get my hands on the Target version, then I was going to get my hands on the Target version. Finally got them off of eBay. These are the Massimo Casey booties. They hit at just like the perfect point on my ankle. They have a snap enclosure, so that's how you get yourself in and out. And then they have like just the right amount of uh, peep toe. It's just like a cute little peep toe. It's not too much or not too little. And then they, you guys can see they have like the open heel. These are going to be like my shoes of the spring and the summer. Um, they did not have the size. They did not have my size in black. These also come in black and brown. These are the um, beige shade. But I want the black ones, but if I can't find them, then maybe I'll just get the Steve Madden version of the black ones. But I'm so excited about these. So excited. Um, the first thing is an anorak. And this is from Windsor. It's just an olive-toned anorak. I have another anorak that was my little brother's when he was in elementary school. And when, then when he grew out of it, he gave it to me because I can fit into it because... I can fit into children's size clothes sometimes. And his is, because he wore it when he was so young, it does kind of, um, it needs to be like three quarter sleeves all the time. And I wanted one that I can wear long sleeved. So I got this one from Windsor. It also has a hood on it, which I think is really cute. It's got gold hardware and I love it. This is gonna be perfect for spring and summer because I live up north and it's still cool at night and even sometimes there'll just be random cold days. So I'm always wearing sweaters or jackets, even at bonfires or, you know, I'm always wearing a sweater or a jacket because I get cold really easy. I'll show you two things I got from Target. The first one is from the brand Exhilaration, and it's just a white crew neck sweater. I got it on clearance for like three bucks, and I mean, when am I not going to wear a white crew neck sweater? It's really cute, fits me, and it kind of has like this... Um, weird material in the front. It's different, but it's cotton. I like this a lot. My white balance is getting thrown off so bad. I got another top from Target, again from the brand Exhilaration. It was super cheap. I paid three bucks for this. And it's a light blush toned cotton t-shirt. And this is about as pink as I will go. I'm not really a huge fan of pink clothes or just the color pink in general, but because this is like such a light blush tone, it almost looks white. I feel like it's more my style. It has a nice scoop neck and it comes down in the butt a little bit. I mean like the shirt would hang over your butt. I got this high neck tank from Windsor and I like showing off my back and my shoulders and this shows off your shoulders. I got another high neck tank. This is a high neck white halter. It comes up to a square. Love this and it shows off again your back and shoulders and these two were both from Windsor. The rest of the stuff I got is from Abercrombie. Actually, Megan and Liz were the ones who started shopping at Abercrombie again and then told me like I needed to go check it out because it's not, it doesn't say like Abercrombie on it anymore and they don't even put that uh, mousse on their clothes anymore so you wouldn't even tell that it's from Abercrombie. So I got this, it's a crop top with long sleeves and you guys can see it kind of crisscrosses at the center got is really similar to that one I just showed you but this is the off the shoulder long sleeve crop top that I wore in my Kendall Jenner tutorial and a few of you guys were asking where I got it and it's from Abercrombie again it's like a longer crop so with high-waisted jeans or high-waisted pants in general it just shows off the right amount of skin I got a plain white Henley and it has bronze buttons on it. It's ribbed, so again, it's that slimming type of a material. Um, I got another high waisted, high waisted, another high neck tank. This one's from Abercrombie as well. Comes up high, and then it's sleeveless. It is cropped, so I only wear cropped things with high waisted things. It's black tank top that has a crisscross in the back, and it comes up high. In the neck so again doesn't show off the boobies but you can show off your back and your shoulders I got this plain maroon 
burgundy tank and I really like these because they're double layered so you can't see through them because there's two layers of material and the inside layer is really thick so you can pretty much wear whatever color bra you want underneath and people won't be able to see it but it's just loose and flowy and I really liked the color. Then I got that same tank that I just showed you. I got it in white. Um, even though this one has double layers, I would still stick to a nude bra with this, but it just has thin spaghetti straps and then it's nice and loose at the bottom. Next tank that I got is this one. It's kind of like a spicy pepper color. I loved the color so I really wanted to get it and it has this cool crisscross pattern in the back where the straps meet if I hold it like that. I just thought that this would be perfect for summer. Whatever I want, I don't even know what I was going with that sentence. I just thought that would be a really nice color for summer. <laughs> then I got this black tank again. Comes up high in the neck, sleeveless, and then it has a button enclosure in the back. So it comes up high in the neck and in the back, but it shows off your shoulders. I got that same black tank. I got it in white. And this one's pretty see-through, so you should probably wear like a booby tube underneath it. And same thing, comes up high in the neck, button enclosure in the back, and it's sleeveless, and it's just light and flowy. So that white tank was the last piece of clothing that I got for this haul. I hope you guys liked this haul. Do you like this haul? Do you want more hauls? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Um, I will have all the information on my Bobble Bar promo code located down below. Don't forget to come follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll have those linked down below as well. Please leave some comments down below on this video so that we can talk to each other. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.